Hey you guys, welcome back. Uh, just a DIY and a small vase arrangement. So I used some hydrangea. I got this from the local Publix um, and they're $4 for the pack. So there's two stems, $4. And um, these are all the leaves that I'm just gonna remove. And I got a vase. This one's a uh, different size, different shape, but um, it's, it's a nice size vase for this. The flower food that came with it, I'm just going to use part of it. You don't have to use all of it, so um, you can save the rest for when you're actually changing water. So I didn't have some garden shears, so I just broke this piece off. But if you have some shears that are better, please go ahead and use those. Um, you don't want to really chew at the stem, but um, you know this works for me, and it did work. So. I go ahead and size it and then I trim it down as I need to. If you go too short, then that's what you're left with. So try to um, see how tall you want it and then cut based on that and you can always go shorter if you want. So I filled the water already, there's flower food, now I've arranged um, the hydrangea. Now I think they just make a statement by themselves. They're actually really pretty, the leaves are nice and I'm, I'm just going to leave them as is. And then as you can see, the vase actually is just a plain vase. So I'm gonna go ahead and use some ribbon and see if I can just embellish it some. I just had some regular, it's a thin, not too wide ribbon and I'm gonna play with it to see what looks pretty, what doesn't. And of course the ribbon can always be changed out based on season, based on your mood or what you have laying around if it does get all wet or spoiled over time. So I'm just gonna make a simple bow for this but as you will see I'll go ahead and change it around as well so I ended up changing my mind and I used another ribbon as well as you can see with the finished product and this is how it turned out I thought it uh, looked cute so the second arrangement I used a ragu pizza sauce bottle I cleaned it out took the label off and then I had some of this burlap style cover and some ribbon and some twine that I And used. so for this next one, I went ahead and, you know, used the flower food and also filled it up to the level of water that I needed. I just kind of eyeballed it according to the flowers. Um, these colors were more fall-like fall and um, I did this video a while back. So obviously you could put some valentine flowers in there some red flowers or anything to set the mood and the tone and uh, here i am just cutting off the stems and i'll go ahead and just eyeball and measure how high they um, need to be but also removing again all the leaves that will be sitting in the water you do not want to do that because that will just ruin the water the leaves will brown quicker and get dark too so Again, just clean off what you can and um, then get it ready to set up. Rearrange it if you need to and move the flowers about. And then um, go ahead and set it up. And uh, next I was working on the decorative element. Um, I just cut and measured as I needed. Um, I actually cut and then folded in half. It was just a little bit less messy to do it that way. And so I'm not gonna actually glue it on there, but I'm gonna use another strip of ribbon um, that goes over it to hold it in place. So again, you can use whichever kind of ribbon or decorative elements that is for the event or the mood. Um, that you're looking to get. I just happened to have this around and I thought it would look nice with the flowers and so that's what I ended up using. And it's fairly simple. Again, you can um, do this with any small vase or arrangement at any time that you like. And I was gifting this to somebody so I added a tag. I just used the twine and attached it along around the vase, as you would call it. And that's it. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. If you like this video and it was helpful, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. But this is how it turned out and I think um, it's a nice gift and it's a nice, uh, you know, piece to liven up your home or your counter up as well. So take care and until next time, enjoy.